U.S. Senator Joni Ernst was back on Capitol Hill today this afternoon. She spoke at a press conference saying American lives are still at stake as they are hostage of Hamas. Currently, we have six Americans that are being held in Gaza by Hamas. And we must remember that Hamas killed over 30 American citizens during their October 7th terror attacks in Israel. Folks, Americans were taken. They must come home. And every second matters. Senator Ernst speaking on this afternoon after returning back to the U.S. leading a delegation to the Middle East. The bipartisan bicameral delegation met there with leaders and negotiators in Israel, Egypt, Qatar and Bahrain. She says the mission for the delegation was to use congressional leverage to bring those American hostages home. And this, as Secretary of State Antony Blinken is on a mission in Israel to try and ease tensions and prevent widespread conflict in the region. Our Washington correspondent Jesse Chenur reports now on what came from his meetings today. We want this war to end as soon as possible. The top U.S. diplomat is on the ground in Israel to try to broker peace. And despite tensions building this week, Secretary of State Antony Blinken says the leaders he met with did agree. Escalation is in no one's interest. Blinken says his talks made progress Tuesday, particularly for northern Gaza, which Israeli forces have surrounded since October. Blinken says the United Nations will now be able to assess when people could safely return. As soon as conditions allow, we want to see people be able to move back to their homes. Lincoln says ultimately ending the war will require guaranteed security for Israelis and political rights for Palestinians. Our choices need to be made in order to get there, but you can see that, that possibility. Many protesters made it clear, though, they're tired of waiting. From outside Blinken's meetings in Israel to inside President Biden's remarks in South Carolina Monday. I've been quietly working with the Israeli government to get them to reduce and significantly get out of Gaza. But some members of Congress want to see a stronger response from the president, particularly when it comes to adversaries in the Middle East, like Iran. The best way we can help our friends is to restore our own credibility in the region. In Washington, I'm Jesse Tenor.